Okay friends, today we will learn about the excretory system. Excretory system means we will know about the process excretion. Now what does this excretion mean? Excretion means removal of harmful waste or nitrogenous waste from the body is known as excretion. And this function is done by the organs of excretory system. This is very important that the waste should get out of our body. Otherwise, it will get deposit in our body and we will face death. So, it plays a very important role. Now, there are different types of nitrogenous waste. There are three types of nitrogenous waste. Ammonia, urea and uric acid. In ammonia, the aquatic or the waste generated by aquatic animals is known as ammonia. Urea, the waste generated by terrestrial animals is known as urea. The waste generated by birds and some insects is known as uric acid. So these are the different kinds of waste generated by different kinds of animals. Aquatic animals which live in water. Terrestrial animals which live on earth. And birds live in the sky. So now let's move to the structure of urinary system or excretory system. The main organ of the excretory system is kidneys. You can see this vein being like a structure. This is left kidney and this is a right kidney. Kidney is bean shaped. This is a frequently asked question in many Olympiads also. That what is the shape of kidney? So that is bean shaped. Next is ureter. You can see both of the kidneys are attached to the urinary bladder through some tube-like structure. These tube-like structure are known as ureter. Then comes the urinary bladder. The urinary bladder also play a vital role in the process of excretion. The all the waste generated in our body is stored in this urinary bladder. Urinary bladder expands when there is a high amount of waste there. And it contracts when waste is released from our body. The last come urethra. Urethra is the passage through which the waste removes from our body. Then you can see more tube like structures present here. Renal vein and renal artery. Same in the next this kidney renal vein and renal artery. Now what is renal vein? Let me tell you the word renal is related to kidney. Wherever you see the word renal it is always related to kidney. As whenever you see the word cardiac, it is related to heart. Now, renal vein. Renal vein is also known as kidney vein or kidney artery. Now you can see these tube-like structures here. Can you guess what are these? Yes. They are inferior vena cava and Orta artery. Here the orta artery carries oxygenated blood from heart to kidney and 
द इन्फीरियर वेना कावा कैरीज डी ऑक्सीजनेटेड ब्लड फ्रॉम किडनी टू हर्ट देन लेट्स टॉक अबाउट दिस किडनी अ किडनी कंटेन्स ट्रिलियंस ऑफ स्मॉल स्ट्रक्चर्स कॉल्ड नेफ्रोन्स दीज नेफ्रोन्स हैव दियर डिफरेंट स्ट्रक्चर इन विच द प्यूरिफिकेशन ऑफ ब्लड टेक्स प्लेस सो द बेसिक यूनिट ऑफ किडनी इज नेफ्रोन सो वी शुड बी नोन बाय दीज थिंग्स now the last point our excretory system our excretory system is present in the dorsal abdomen of our body now what is dorsal abdomen it means in the back side of our body at the back portion of our body our excretory system is present so let's have a take a look on the important points of this topic renal artery is also known as kidney artery renal vein is also known as kidney vein shape of kidney is bean shaped inferior vena cava carry deoxygenated blood from kidney to heart aorta artery carry oxygenated blood from heart to kidney now human excretory system organs a pair of kidneys is present you can see in the diagram a pair of kidneys is present then a pair of ureters you can see both the kidneys are connected to a tube like structure called ureter then urinary bladder so here we can see this balloon like structure urinary bladder at the last urethra which is the ending part of our excretory system then our excretory system is present in the dorsal abdomen of our body unit of kidney is nephron and the covering of kidney is called renal capsule one of the important point that covering of kidney is called a renal capsule so that's all let's meet in the next video